everybody how are you today it's a wet old day here again the weather is so up and down it's driving me mad it doesn't help with the aches and pains does it and today we're going to do Holly's tag or attempt to and I'm going to change Ginny and I'm going to change her into this very pretty dress it's white and it's got kittens running around the bottom of it and they're white and grey and black and some of them are stripy like the kitten that Kylie Cat S sent us and it's got orange across the front of the bodice and an orange Peter Pan collar very pretty little dress and silvery grey shoes with a grey flower on the front the orange shrug cardigan that Auntie Pauline kindly sent us and an orange headband, a hard headband with butterflies and flowers on. And Ginny wanted to let you know that we have chosen a name for her kitten and because she has a pink nose we've decided it's going to be a girl and her name will be Jane Away and that's a character in Star Trek Voyager because Kylie Cat S is really into Star Trek Voyager and so am I. So we've decided that she's going to be Jane away. Jessica and Joseph are both sitting in the Moses basket today and Freddie, I don't know what Fred is up to, he's playing with one of the elephants managed to get his dummy out so I hope you'll be able to hear me okay but we're dressed Ginny hope you're seeing her okay let me just lighten you up a little bit right Ginny I'm not going to change her socks come on darling hello sweetheart she's such a good girl aren't you Mwah. take her little headband off And I've just realised I've said the word, haven't I? Well, I didn't do too bad, did I? I must have got in a little bit into this before I said it. But it was the headband that was my downfall. So, sorry about that. <laughs> I did my best. <laughs> Never mind. There we go. There's Ginny. She's a special girl, isn't she, my Ginny? I love her. And congratulations to Shannon, because Shannon got a Frida sculpt as well in her nursery. Looks very different to my Ginny, but she's very pretty. She looks much younger than Ginny, because Ginny looks quite, quite an older little girl, aren't you, darling? But we like that, don't we? Yes, we do, cheeky. And we're going to take your cardigan off. I'm going to leave the same socks on her because they're really pretty socks. Um, and I think they go well with the dress. My son got over to Paris okay. Thank you so much for all your lovely comments yesterday. It really helped to know that you understood how I was feeling. Um yeah very tense he's out and about with his friends so all i can do is hope that there's no trouble in paris at all i mean i don't want there to be trouble for anybody anywhere but you know what i mean there we go Ginny. let's take off your top this is a very tight top actually um, I might mention it when I go into M&Co this week to the people in there that they have made the top for this very small for a child that's supposed to be three to six months. So, you know, it really is very snug. I wouldn't like to try that on a, on a real baby, to be honest, because it's very small. Here you go, Ginny. The nap is all right, I think, because we changed that last time, didn't we? Yes, we did. Let's just make sure you straighten it up a bit. I did get some bigger ones, actually, because I thought these were size 2, and I think they sent me the wrong ones, so I did contact them, and I will be getting another one. We need a, 
onesie for you, darling. I didn't realise you didn't have one on, so I'll just get her a onesie. Where's my bigger onesies? There's one. There we go. Get you a clean onesie, darling. Should we put a bit of baby smell on you? just give her a bit of baby smell because I do like the smell hope you're still seeing her okay let me just check yeah you are aren't you doing okay there we go can't remember what I was talking about now what was I talking about Ginny what's your mummy like she can never remember anything can she I'm hopeless your mum is hopeless. If I had a brain, I'd be dangerous, wouldn't I, Ginny? Yes, I would. There we go. There's a good girl. Nice clean onesie for you. Seems a bit strange in, in the house without my son here. I'm so used to him... You know, having someone to chatter to because me and my husband don't talk that much really because he's deaf. It's, it, you know, it's one of those things it's very, very complicated to do with him. So we tend not to talk that much and it's usually my son that I chat to. Have you come, darling? I'm hoping this is going to fit her. I think this was actually bought for Sophie. But I think it should fit her. It's three to six months, so. There we go, Ginny. Up you come, darling. You sit on the edge for mummy. There she is. Such a sweet girl, aren't you? Yes, you are. I don't know if you can still see her, but I'm just doing her dress up. Got a little button on the waistband here which is a bit awkward to do up especially when your fingers don't work hey eh, Ginny it's a bit tight isn't it is that it yeah nearly got it yeah it was very strange here yesterday and it seems very strange today because I'm so used to having my son here <laughs> oh, she's a good girl yeah that fits you nice Ginny that's very pretty with all the kittens on isn't it very pretty dress put your shoes on I got these shoes actually from China because I wanted some grey coloured shoes and they were advertised as grey but they're actually more silver than they are grey I mean the the flower on the front is grey. They're quite nice, aren't they? How are you doing with her? She's it's a trouble with a bigger baby. That looks really pretty on her, doesn't it? What do you think with the kittens? I like that. It's a very pretty dress. I wish I could remember who sent it. I'm almost sure it was Inez. But I'm sure you'll let me know if it was you or somebody else. Let's just take your little label off, Ginny, and we'll get your cardigan on because it's really not warm enough not to have a cardigan today. I'm back in my jumpers again. I did some knitting yesterday, try and distract myself a bit. There we go, Ginny. Let's just sit you up, darling. There we are. There we go. Let's have your other little hands where you are. There you are. It's very awkward because her hands are so splayed out. There we go. That's a very pretty cardigan, isn't it? 
So thank you, Auntie Pauline, for that. And congratulations on your new baby. She's very pretty. If you haven't seen Pauline's new baby, do pop across and have a look. She's a very pretty little girl. Let's just get some spray and we'll do your hair, darling. That's it. Let's sit her up and do her hair and I'll see if you're if you can see her okay. There she is. She's sitting waiting patiently for her mummy, aren't you? Yes, you are. Look at the state of your hair, Ginny. Look at the state of your hair. I do like her hair in bunches, actually, but I tend to do that when she's in jeans or something that's a bit more tomboyish. There you go, sweetheart. She's got such beautiful hair. Yeah, congratulations to everybody that's got new babies this week. I see there's quite a few new babies in the community. So congratulations, everybody. There you go, darling. I'm still waiting on news of mine. I think she's um, being rooted. She's got to be rooted yet. So it'll be a while before I get her. There you go, Ginny, with her pretty kitten dress on. And she's got Jane away with her. That looks really cute. This this uh, cat, this little kitten comes from Aurora Tiny Critters, I think they're called. Really cute little cat, isn't it? So there she is. Let me just move back a little bit so you can see the full effect sitting with her kitten with her little kitten dress on isn't that cute on her and i popped the bedding into the pram for little miss mary ann and i had to put the this is a peter rabbit blanket a gray one but this actually fitted over the mattress beautiful Sue she looks really nice on her so I've just popped that I have found a lady in Australia actually who does Peter Rabbit bedding so I will be getting in touch with her and what are you doing Freddie what are you doing are you trying to pull that elephant down at least you haven't been too noisy today have you there we go so there's my beautiful girl in her kitten dress and i'm sorry that i bowed i did my best but it is very hard not to say the word little but i did my best <laughs> have a lovely rest of your day ladies Ginny's gonna say bye bye you're gonna say bye bye to everybody darling say Mwah! big kisses see you at story time and a big kiss from me Mwah! love you ladies